What is clear is the future of Afghanistan remains a key issue for us. It affects us, it affects the region, the international stability, and it has a direct impact on European security. At the same time, the ministers strongly insisted on the idea that uh, we remain committed to supporting the Afghan population. Uh, who will uh, brief you shortly about the outcome of the discussions by the ministers on... In order to support the Afghan population, we will have to engage with the new government in Afghanistan, which doesn't mean recognition. It's an operational engagement. And this operational engagement will increase depending on the behavior of this government. And in order to measure the behavior, we need benchmarks. Conference in the afternoon stays as planned, so we will be then uh, given the opportunity to ask the question. We will judge the behavior and so will engagement according with the commitment of the Afghan government for Afghanistan not to serve as a base for the export of terrorism to other countries. Second, the respect for human rights, in particular women's rights, the rule of law, and freedom of the media. And this political platform will consider, among other issues, the management of population flows from Afghanistan, the prevention of the spread of terrorism, to fight against organized crime, including drug trafficking and human being smuggling. Representative Minister. Hvala lepa. Najprej, hkrati smo se vsi skupaj zazeli, da je treba okrepiti napore, da iz Afganistana uspemo pripeljati še tiste sodelavce skupne zunanje službe in držav članic, ki so zaradi prekinitve zračnega mostu ostali ujeti v Afganistanu in da moramo usmeriti vse napore v oblikovanje tako imenovanega regionalnega kompakta, preko katerega bomo uspeli nagovoriti morebitne migracijske pritiske v prihodnje. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> 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 <laughs>